Now, along with your keys, your cell phone, your wallet, we've added masks to our list of things to grab before we head out the door. You've probably seen a lot of people that hang theirs from their rearview mirror in the car. I see a lot of that driving around. I do as well. New this morning, I actually got a look into a young boy's bar mitzvah project. In a We See You KSHB report, he gives masks a little flair while helping families who are food insecure. Walking down the streets, grocery stores, airports, face coverings are the current reality. And for seventh grader Jonas Stein, he wanted to add a little more to these masks. So these are masquerades. They're basically necklaces for your masks. When you're not wearing them, they can kind of just hang down so they're not in the way. The reason why he's doing it? At the start of the pandemic, you could just see lines of people trying to get food, just waiting for food to be put in their cars. For his project, he's raising money, selling these masquerades, benefiting the Jewish Family Services. Jonah is just such a great example of one person making a huge impact. From produce to toiletries and protein, the organization has seen the need grow. We at least doubled during COVID. So we were serving, you know, over 500 families a month. And then by the end of this year, we're going to serve about, you know, between October, November, December, 1,500 households. So that's not individuals, but that's households. The funds raised for masquerades would go towards these. Kesher KC bags. Some essentials of like just some heat up meals and food. And then they also just have some like resources. These bags are a really awesome way for us to, to create a stopgap for people. Now, Jonah's goal was to raise $1,800 for JFS with his project, but he underestimated himself. It's been amazing. We've raised $7,600 and still climbing for JFS. Thousands of dollars raised to help serve families he may never meet. Even though I might not meet them, I know it kind of just either it brings a, a smile to their face and it can fill their stomach and just helps everyone and makes me happy in that way. Jonah was so cool. Yeah. He was so cool. He says it's also a fun way to spend time with family because, you know, everyone is working from home and yep. some take five minutes in his family's, others take a little longer. He didn't want to call out any family member. And he can also actually do like custom ones okay. like Chiefs colors, Mizzou colors, K State, Bengals, you know. <laughs> if you want to find out more, you can head out to our website at kshb.com to learn more about these masquerades. Cincinnati native Ray Daniel throwing in a little, a little thought process little, there. Yeah. I was just thinking we're going to get mad because people, we didn't say, KU and then she throws in Bengals there. Did <laughs> well, you end KU up with colors? Of course. Did KU you get? Did you get one? Like I did. You, I got a Chiefs one. That's phenomenal. And seventy six hundred dollars right, right already. That's really incredible. I love Amazing. that. Amazing.